Hello, everyone, and welcome to the CPA BC's Convocation Ceremony. Good morning. My name is Stefano Giulianetti, and I will be your MC today, and it is my pleasure to be a part of this fantastic event and meet all these fantastic people today alongside you all. I would like to acknowledge the importance of the land, which we each call home, wherever that might be. And I'd like to acknowledge the traditional territories of the Coast Salish people, in particular, the Squamish, Musqueam, and Tsleil-Waututh First Nations, on whose territory the CPA BC's offices are located. We do this land acknowledgement to reaffirm our commitment and responsibility in improving relationships between nations and to improving our own understanding of Indigenous peoples. Please, join me in a moment of reflection. Thank you. Now, this is a momentous day for our graduates, and in just a moment, they will be entering the ballroom along with our platform guests. Their entrance will be projected onto the screens to my left and to my right, and I encourage you all to applaud as loudly as you want and can as they enter. Additionally, throughout the day, you'll be taking photos, I'm sure, so don't forget to follow us on social media and share those photos and uh, use the hashtag CPABC, and that is the hashtag pound symbol for some of us that are a little older. Everyone, please rise for the entrance of our graduates and platform guests. This is where we start clapping. Keep it going.
Well, we, we almost ran out a little of steam a little bit there on the clapping, but if the Piper can do it, I think we can all do it as well. Wonderful, thank you to the fantastic Piper for that entrance, and yes. I was gonna suggest that you may all be seated, but I think you've all uh, knew what the next thing was going to be. That's great. Congratulations, welcome again, and welcome grads. Let's give them one more, come on. I would now like to introduce Indigenous leader Carla George. Carla is Squamish from her father's side of the family and Kwayuki from her mother's side of the family. She is a member of the Nicola Valley Institute of Technology's Board of Governors, and we are honored to have her join us today, and she will now provide a traditional welcome to our graduates. Welcome, Carla. Just sharing with you who I am and where I come from. I am Skhotmish and Kwakwakikiwak. My father is Skhotmish, my mother is Kwagyot. Uh, very fortunate to have uh, learned my language and some of my songs and being grounded and connected in who I am. Uh, just really honored to be here with each and every one of you and to celebrate you and your hard work uh, to achieve this accreditation today and to be able to move on to having a career and getting out of debt a little bit, I think. <laughs> Just congratulating your, uh, your parents who obviously have supported you, your partners, your siblings, your grandparents, all those that are coming here to celebrate you today. I just seen everyone who looks so, so happy and proud of all of you that uh, have achieved this, uh, you know, the blood, sweat and tears, some of those nights where you're just like, I can't do it, and you get up and you do it again. And I, I've been there in, in a different capacity, but uh, I know it's a lot of work. And so just really, really pleased to be here to, to honor you and acknowledge your, your amazing work with the, these beautiful people. And just uh, thank you, Tracy, for reaching out and including me. Um, I wanted to share a song, Not to Quick Quink, a long time ago. This song came to Sisoliat, and it was my late grandmother's, uh, one of her favorite songs, and uh, Tum Tum Slolam, uh, which is a snowbird song, uh, came from the late 1800s, and uh, so we keep these songs alive for future generations, that we continue to stand here being strong and proud and sharing who we are as Indigenous people in our own lands, and so, on behalf of the Skhotmish, I welcome you. Um, there's, uh, in this territory, we have the Musqueam, Squamish, and tsleil but I am representing the Skhotmish today, and uh, we'll sing Tum Tum Slolem to welcome each and every one of you and to honor each and every one of you as well. Hosea.
Siam Chen Clemento Mi Siam and Tia Isa I hold my hands up. I'm showing you I'm coming with no weapons when we would come in our canoes. If we were coming quietly, we were coming to war. When you see us holding our hands up, that's our way of giving thanks and letting you know my hands are free and I'm welcoming each and every one of you and continue to walk safely in our territory as you do the good work that we, you, you will do in your futures. Chen Clemento Mi Siam and Tia Isa Thank you. Thank you, Carla, for welcoming our grads. Now, let's acknowledge our distinguished guests. Please stand as I introduce you. No, not you. Please stand as I introduce you. And audience members, please do hold your applause until everyone is introduced, and then we'll give them the love altogether. We are delighted to have the following people with us today. Sheila Nelson, CPA BC's board chair. Richard Ulfert, CPA Canada's board chair. And Lori Matheson, CPA BC's president and CEO. Our platform guests. Thank you. We'd also like to acknowledge uh, the following groups and individuals who play an important role at the CPA Professional Education Program. There's CPA BC's Board of Directors. <laughs> CPA BC's Executive Management Committee. <laughs> the CPA Western School of Business and we are pleased to have the school's CEO Yuan Ip with us today. As well, representative from, representatives from post-secondary institutions in BC that serve as key partners in the recruitment and education of future CPAs. <laughs> Wonderful. Now, it is, my, it is my pleasure to welcome CPA BC's board chair, Sheila Nelson, to extend her congratulations to the graduates. Sheila. Hello, everyone. Uh, so great to see all of you here. Um, I'm so excited. This is such a great event, so thank you, everyone, for being here. On behalf of CPABC's Board of Directors, congratulations to our graduates. It is my great pleasure to be here today with your family members and friends as we celebrate your achievements during your years of studies. Graduates, I would like to acknowledge your hard work and commitment. The CPA program is rigorous and it takes determination and a high level of skill to complete it. But you have succeeded. And in the process, you have developed unmatched accounting, leadership, and management skills. I would also like to recognize your adaptability to succeed in your studies during the pandemic required great flexibility and resilience. As we all know, there is a lot of uncertainty in our world, but one thing is clear. You have an important role to play in guiding our, our world for the better. Members of our profession have the knowledge and experience to provide trusted, ethical, and strategic guidance. Whether you are advising nonprofits, supporting small businesses, leading organizations, or driving sustainable, sustainability strategies, you have the ability to provide assurance and growth and to contribute to prosperity. Today is a day to celebrate the bright future you have in front of you. The road ahead is full of opportunities for personal and professional growth and chances to make important contributions to your community. We are so excited to see where you go next. Congratulations, and I wish all of you the best of luck. Thank you. Thank you, Sheila. I would like to invite Richard Olfert, the board chair of CPA Canada, CPA Canada to address our graduates now. Richard. Uh, 
Thank you for the warm welcome. It's indeed an honor to be here to celebrate together with BC's newest graduates. You've worked incredibly hard to reach this very significant milestone, so congratulations to each and every one of you. And let's also take a moment to acknowledge the family and friends and colleagues who have supported and encouraged you throughout the CPA program. It's been just a few years since I sat in your seat. Let's just say it was a time when pagers roamed the earth and CPA exams were handwritten, color-coded by day, and sip shipped in secure boxes for evaluation using paper marking guides. An awful lot has changed since then. But several things continue to hold true. The standard for admission to our profession is as rigorous as it has always been. And CPAs remain invaluable to organizations across every sector of our economy. The versatility of the CPA designation is impressive. And at the risk of sounding cliche, a career in accounting can truly take you anywhere. Along my own journey, the experience and transferable skills I gained have taken this shy kid from the north part of Winnipeg to places that I once would have thought were completely unimaginable. Working alongside skilled entrepreneurs, advising provincial government leaders, contributing in the boardrooms of some of the country's largest corporations. And now, imagine leading CPA Canada's board of directors. All of these incredibly rewarding experiences courtesy of our fantastic profession. Wherever your interests lie, you will have the opportunity to lead meaningful and purpose-driven work. Far from being replaced by technology or software systems, CPAs have never been in more demand for our ability to synthesize information and to guide sound decision-making in a world that's just overloaded with data. And beyond our financial expertise, CPAs add value through strong acumen, through good governance, and, in an, and using an ethical mindset that's grounded on discipline and on fairness. You now belong to a community of 220,000 CPAs across Canada, each of whom are contributing to a more resilient e ecosystem across Canada and globally. Working collectively, we can continue to build a stronger profession, one that anticipates change and one that successfully navigates the challenges and the opportunities of tomorrow. As I look around the room, I see the next generation of CPAs, bright, ambitious, and well on your way to becoming future leaders. I have no doubt that each of you will go on to accomplish very great things. Congratulations, and welcome to the profession. Thank you, Richard. Thank you very much. Well, yeah, this is it. It is now time for the presentation of our graduates. How does that feel? Yeah. Now, graduates, as you cross the stage, if you'd like to acknowledge any of the platform guests with a nod or a bow, please do feel free to do so. Uh, but for health and safety reasons, please kindly refrain from shaking hands. As you come off the stage, the CPA staff members will direct you back to your seat. I would kindly ask that you and your guests remain in your seats for the rest of the ceremony until all of the graduates have been recognized and to hear your class valedictorian's address. I will be introducing each of the graduates in alphabetical order. Graduates, enjoy this moment, all of you, right there, I'm watching you. Enjoy this moment, because it marks the culmination of all your hard work, the determination, the sacrifice during your educational journey. You ready for this? <laughs> I am. Are you ready for this?
Now, here are the CPABC graduates. Monique Aquan Vieira. <laughs> Kemi Akinsope. Tyler Andrews. Joelle Antonison. Eric Austin. Rahul Bali. Akash Bansal. Claire Batty. Mario Bayou Vascaro. Sandeep Bengag. Vinny Barti. Danbir Bui. Cameron Bird. Dustin Bissonnette. Alexander Black. James Bodner. Amrik Boparai. Emily Buto. Ryan Britz. Mariah Cockell. Thank you. Taranjit Chawla. Taranjit Singh Chawla. Mindy Chen. Thank you. Shin Chen. Thank you. Jay Cheng. Jason Cheng.
Look up. Hiten Chabra. Courtney Chu. Thank you. Yunju Choi. Thank you. Adam Chu. Brianne Clegg. Thank you. Haley Koss. Thank you. Laura Crow Hutchin. Cameron Curley. Bernice Dancat. Thank you, Marcy. Marcy de Medeiros. Gagan Diol. Arian Dervina. Thank you. Janish Desai. Diraj Dillon. <laughs> Nicholas DiMarco. Thank you. Kyler. Kyler Doxy. Ning Dong. <laughs> Jessica Drummond. <laughs> Kai Duggan. Serbi Dutta. Ebert. Is it Ebert? Matthew Ebert. Kasani Edmonds. Farhad Esmail. <laughs> Nicholas Espinosa. <laughs> Michael Fenato. Julia Findlay. Jack Finley. Louise Fung.
Gurneet Gambier. Phyllis Gao. Crystal Gao. Suraj Gida. Sean Gill. Ravinder Gill. Sarataj Gill. Ernesto Gonzalez Lopez. Gagandeep Graywall. Tejinder Graywall. Judy Gu. Brianna Guys. Thank you. Rory Haynes. Marianne Hernandez. <laughs> Pasan Hetiar Chichi. Caitlin Ho. Pamela Ho. Thank you. Lauren Holly. Iris Sue. Mingu Huang. Thank you. Nicole Hutchinson. Thank you. Oh. Zemfira Yakina. Tyler Iwanson. Amy Yance. Ran Jing. Pavneet Johal. Thank you. Jennifer Jung. Thank you. Darn beer, Kingsley. Kingsley. 
Tarnvir Kainth. Tanish Kakar. Thank you. Lena Kalke. Thank you. Is it Kaur? Kaur. Sharon Preet Kaur. Sukmeet Kaur. Alyssa Kishani. Alyssa Kishani. Thank you. Muhammad Ali Kaku. Muhammad Ali Kaku. Mina Kim. Is it Kohli? Yeah. Preet Aman Kohli. Thank you. Got it. Aisha Kaur. Phoebe Kotulska. Thank you. Is it Lalit? Lalit Kumar. It's Quo. Alice Quo. Yejung Kwan. Oh, yeah. Gabriel La Guerta. Thank you. Lamarche. Eric Lamarche. Rishab Lamba. Hello. Megan Christine Lau. Thank you. Amanda Latos. Brandon Lee. Thank you. Ted Lee. Thank you. Vanessa Lee. Dylan Lepp. Thank you. Is it Jiru? Jiru. Jiru Lee. Is it lie? Is it lie? 
Is it lie? Come back, come back, come back, come back, come back. Is it lie? Come back, come back, come back. It's your name, come back. It's Lee? It's really Lee, it really is. J. Ru Lee. It's important. Thank you, everyone. Will Lee. Thank you. Emily Liu. Harris Mack. Michael Malerba. Thank you. Michael McDonald. Thank you. Catherine McKinty. Finley McPhee. Thank you. Priyanka Mehta. Priyanka Mehta. Thank you. Is it Puru? Puru Mehta. Bahare Mohammad Zadeh. Christine Montemayor. Josh Morrison. Radhika Nanavati. Thank you. Is it Ding? Ding. Okay. Lawrence Ng. Thank you for the Ng. Okay. Valerie Ng. Arjun Niranjanan. Thank you. Matthew O'Brien. Is it Okran? Okran. Okran. Richard Okran. Anan Pavi. Hi. Thank you. Marina Parrish. <laughs> Alicia Parmar. Harsh Parmar. Thank you. Pam. Pam. Mia Pam. Thank you. Is it Brad? 
Megan Pratt. Joyce Qualizza. Is it Rawant? Rawant Rahim. Is it Rai? Gurneet Rai. You're all doing so well, by the way. Karanjeet Rana. Carmen Rana. Alyssa Redmile. Yeah. Paul Richard. Samantha Jane Richardson. Melanie Rivera Moran. Evan Rowe. Thank you. Rowley, right? Courtney Rowley. Jaspreet Saini. Thank you. Gurmeet Kaur Sandhu. Kaur, sorry. Gurmeet Kaur Sandhu. Kevin Sandu. Thank you. Karina Sato. Is it Sato? Thank you. Bita Sharoki. Amanda Shang. Thank you. Nitika Sharma. Thank you. Is it Showbridge? Matthew Showbridge. Rajan Shokar. Thank you. Is it Shrestha? Shrestha. Garima Shrestha. Thank you. Darren Sin. Metab Singh. Mani. 
Ani Singh. Lauren Smaha Muir. Raman Sohal. Samantha Solomon. Jose Starkel. Amanda Staviarski. Stephanie Sullivan. Keep those cheers, yeah. Angela. Angela Sun. Paul Sun. Thank you. Is it sweet? Is it sweet? Sweet. Emma Sway. El Shazli Safia. Taranjit Takar. Tyrell Terryberry. Zahar Tirani. Is it Thatch? Sharon Thatch. Michael Tian. Trihoy Tran. <laughs> Niyati Ashokumar Trivedi. <laughs> Felicia Trong. Kavneet Tut. Thank you. Sean Vander Linden. Thank you. Rochelle. Rochelle Velestuk. Helene Andrea Vergara. Jared Verkoski. Thank you. Is it vote? Vote. Tiana Vote.
Fergie Wang. Meng Ching Wang. Thank you. Natasha Vijaya Liao. Maxwell Wildstar. Thank you. Wildman. Wildman, thank you. That's why I asked. Jared Wilman. Evan Wong. Lucas Wong. Thank you. Trevor Woodward. Thank you. Mengzi. Mengzi Wu. Shafan Kellen Wu. Thank you. Is it Yineng? Is it Zhang? Yineng Zhang. Thank you. Oh, yeah, Bavia. Bavia. Haley Young. Hui Wen. Hui Wen Yu. Ji Hei Yun. Claire Zenko. Sisi Zeng. Kejing Zhang. Thank you. Is it Yingxi? Zhang. 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 Say that last name again. Zhang. Yingxi Zhang. Hello. Thank you. Justin Zhu. Ruxiao Zhu. Thank you. Judy Zhu. Oof. Uh, a lot of business cards here. All right, let's see where we take these. 
<laughs> now, we did a lot of clapping, but I would like to ask all the graduates to please rise and face the audience. Thank you. Yes, that's right. Please join me in congratulating the class of 2023. Yes. Congratulations. Wonderful, thank you. Grads, back to your spots. Wonderful, thank you. Oh, that was the hardest part, right? Good job, grads. Good job, family and friends. We all did this together. You did most of the work. All right, I would now like to invite Helen Liu to the stage. Based on her academic achievements, Helen is the valedictorian for the class of 2023. In addition to being a member of the National Honor Roll, Helen is also the recipient of the prestigious Governor General's Gold Medal and the CPA Canada Cash Prize of $5,000 for achieving the highest standing in Canada on, September, on the September 2022 CFE, right? I am very pleased to welcome Helen to the podium here to share her valedictory address. Hi, Helen, congratulations. Did a good job. It's all yours. Family, friends, distinguished guests, and CPA graduates, good morning and thank you for joining us to celebrate the class of 2023. I have to begin with a huge congratulations to all of my fellow graduates. We spent months channeling dozens of different roles in our, C uh, in our practice cases to analyze and recommend on a countless number of issues. We persisted through a difficult three-day exam and we endured 11 more weeks waiting for our CFE results. And finally, we did it. We can be proud of the time and effort that we dedicated and thank ourselves for doing such a great job. I'd also like to thank all of the family members, friends, colleagues, and mentors for all of your continuous and overwhelming support throughout this journey. We couldn't have done it without you. The journey, of course, continues, and as we draw closer to becoming designated, I've thought a lot about what comes next. There are so many opportunities ahead of us, and I'm still exploring them myself. But what I do know is that the CPA program has shown us that we have a lot of strengths that make us well positioned for whichever opportunity we choose to pursue. Today, I'd like to share a few of these strengths. First, we bring resilience. For many of us, we came home after a long day of work to continue to study, all while balancing personal commitments and facing the uncertainties in the world around us. We continue to face new obstacles and new uncertainties, but our resilience and mental strength will allow us to overcome any challenges. We also bring versatility. Not only do we learn how to balance debits and credits, but we developed a toolbox of skills that we can draw from to solve all kinds of problems and meet the diverse needs of our communities. Let's stay curious and continue to expand on this toolbox as we move forward. And finally, we bring the ability to create synergy. One of our greatest strengths comes from being able to help each other and work together. And I've experienced these synergy effects time and time again, whether it be when I was struggling through a CFE practice case or figuring out the solution to a tax issue at work 
or trying to pinpoint a specific career direction for myself. Collaboration and mentorship empower us and allow us to grow both professionally and personally. So today is a huge milestone in all of our careers, and I mean, with all of the strengths that we have, I know we will have many more milestones to come. I look forward to seeing everything that we will achieve, and I'm so excited that we will all be joining the CPA community together. Thank you, and congratulations once again. Well, these next words are maybe a little sad, but maybe they're inspiring as well. I'm, I'm going to be bringing this ceremony to a close, yes. But I'm going to do that by thanking everyone here today for attending this special event to celebrate the achievement of these CPABC graduates. Look at these names here. Look, these are a lot of names we read out today, isn't it? But each of these is an individual and a CPA. Isn't that exciting? Congratulations, we did it! <laughs> Graduates, I encourage you to take this opportunity to thank your family members, your friends, your mentors, your colleagues who have supported you through this long, probably, journey. I'd like to extend also thanks to the CPA Insurance Plans West, who has generously sponsored the video recording of today's events, to our gold level reception sponsor, KPMG, MNP LLP, and to all of our other sponsors. Now, all of you, remember to celebrate and participate in the festivities on social media by sharing your convocation photos for the rest of the day uh, using the hashtag CPABCGrads and graduates. A little bit of housekeeping here. In a moment, you will follow the platform guests out of the ballroom as a group. And all other guests, please do remain in your seats until the, all the graduates have exited, after which you have time and you're free to join them. After you all exited the ballroom, please join us for a complimentary reception, which will be hosted in the ballroom foyer and West Ballroom D uh, from noon until 2 p.m. <sighs> I encourage all of you to join us at the reception and continue celebrating this great day. Everyone, this concludes our convocation ceremony. On behalf of CPABC, thank you again for attending and for supporting the graduates, and we hope to see you all at the reception. Thank you. <laughs>